George Beverly Shea, born in 1909 in Winchester, Ontario, where his dad served as pastor of the Wesleyan Methodist Church, and his mother was the church organist. She had a piano at home that came from England, and seated in front of its keys, she became a sort of human alarm clock for the family. Every weekday morning, striking an E-flat chord, she would start to sing, Singing I go along life's road, praising the Lord, praising the Lord. Singing I go along life's road, for Jesus had lifted my load. When Bev was 21, he began working for the Mutual Insurance Company of New York, assisting medical examiners in obtaining information. Among those who came into the office was Fred Allen, host of a coast-to-coast radio talent show. Learning that Bev liked to sing, Mr. Allen arranged an audition, and a few weeks later, Bev found himself singing Go Down Moses to a nationwide audience on the National Broadcasting Company. He lost the contest to a yodeler, and he received $15. One Sunday, shortly afterwards, Bev sat down at his mother's organ to practice for his morning church service, and his eyes fell on a clipping that she had left for him there, a poem written in 1922 by Mrs. Rhea F. Miller. As Bev read the words, they spoke to him about his own aims and ambitions in life. An appropriate melody came easily, practically composing itself. And in church that morning, Bev sang, I'd rather have Jesus publicly for the first time. It later became a sort of signature song expressing his own decisions in life. I'd rather have Jesus than men's applause. I'd rather be faithful to his dear cause. I'd rather have Jesus than worldwide fame. I'd rather be true to his holy name. Mm -hmm. 